Yeah, we're definitely going in. I just need a second. Yeah, take your time. Oh my god. Hello, is anybody in here? There's probably some Whoa! Oh my god, what's wrong? What's wrong? Oh my god, there's something in here. Oh, let's go! Run, 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 This thing is ripped. Oh, there's something inside of it. Oh, shit. There's literally something written on it. Looks like it says they always lie. What, what am I looking at? I really can't see. It says C3. Oh, C3. Oh my god, C3. Alright guys, uh, we have arrived at our first point. Uh, it's literally on the side of a freaking busy ass highway. Literally, if you look around, there are just mountains, a whole lot of not much. Um, but then when you look this way, there's this thing. I don't know what the hell it is, but there is a thing there. And we're not too sure about it. Um, we don't know like exactly what it is. I don't know. I just see like these weird metal structures sticking out of the ground. Take a look at this. So that is literally what it is that we're seeing right now. I don't even know how well you guys can see that on the camera. The mountains are all down there. But um, what I'm thinking is I might actually send up the drone just to kind of take a uh, closer look at it just to you know see if we can tell what it might be and then we'll decide from there whether we're gonna go in or not because I don't know this one kind of seems a little sketchy and uh, I just don't want to be you know the wrong place at the wrong time so yeah better to be safe than sorry all right guys so uh, as you guys can see I'm literally on the side of the road right now I'm gonna send set up the drone here and basically fly it into there kind of get a glimpse as to what it is to do it. Okay. Let's try and send her up before some more traffic comes and then the uh, drone ends up getting destroyed by a random passing car. Let's see here. She looks hopefully level enough. Just waiting for a few more GPSs. A few more satellites. Point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Okay. And we are up. Alright. Start recording from here so you guys can see whatever it is that I see. I'll send her into sport mode. And uh, just basically start going in. Yeah, so all I was seeing was these two metal things. Jeez, the cars move real quick on this highway. See something? What is that? Whoa, what the heck is that thing? <laughs> what is that? What the hell? What in, what in the world am I looking at? Huh. I don't know what the hell that is. It looks like a bunch of doors, like... That is so weird. <laughs> kind of cool looking though, I don't know what it is. That is wild. No idea. Um, there's like a little building over here. A little closer to that. There's another little thing back there. I don't know what the heck that is. Let's see what this thing is first. There's like a door here. It says, Do not enter. Isis inside. Okay. Let's just make sure we don't run into any like power lines or anything, because that would freaking suck. But yeah, there's literally like a there's a door. I don't know what that is, but huh. Actually, what it kind of looks like, I think it might actually be a missile silo. That's actually pretty cool. actually go in there, but 
I mean, it looks completely abandoned from this vantage point anyway. Weird. So on the top of the building it says Eric was here. I have no idea who Eric is. <laughs> Alright, so it kind of looks pretty interesting. Um, I'll show Jazz what I found and I guess we'll decide from there whether or not we'll actually go into this. What is this thing exactly? There's another like little building here. I don't know what the heck that is. What is that? Looks like a bunch of stacked up stuff. Yeah. Alright, that's kind of cool. <laughs> Yeah, I guess I'll probably take a few more uh, cinematic shots and uh, we're going to decide in a few moments whether or not we want to go in. Hey guys, there it is, all the way in the back there. Um, we are going to make our way inside. I don't know what the hell Jazz is doing, but... Uh, What's up? I just read that sign. Yeah? You won't believe what it says. Does it say no Bosnians allowed? Fuck you. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> um, yeah. You ever yeah. just try like unlocking it? No. You think it would unlock? No, I guess you need a key for it. Is there like a ring doorbell you could like ask if you could go inside? Yeah, there's an actual like lock right on it, so. Well, looks like this is a dud. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, turn your camera off and then we'll just magically appear on the other side. As soon as I snap my fingers, we're just gonna teleport. You guys ready? Watch this. We're not gonna jump All the fence. Alright, right. let's go. Three, two, one. And just like that, we've made it to the other side. I don't know how we did it, but like... I don't know, that was like magic. We definitely didn't jump the fence right Yeah, there was, a guy who, there was a guy who literally whistled at you. Called me yeah, he literally... <laughs> that was awesome. Whew. I think we uh, got here just in the nick of time, maybe? Because looks like the yeah, sun's going down. Yeah. Here we go. <sighs> kind of nervous about this one. I mean, well, we could like... Shaking. Bro, we could like run into some like weird stranger things type of stuff. That's what I'm thinking. That's, that's what this reminds me of. Right? It's literally what I'm the thinking. Bunker underground. Right? Where Eleven was doing the <laughs> you know I mean? That's true, that's true. Oh man, let us know in the comments below if you guys have seen the latest season of Stranger Things because it was f***ing awesome. I, I don't know who in the world has it. Yeah. I know some people, but I don't talk to those people. I've cut them off in my life. If you don't watch Stranger Things, we cannot be friends. <laughs> I'm literally just joking, but this is so exciting. Also <laughs> oh, watch out for the rattlesnake. Yeah, that is a really long thing. Okay, here we go. Okay, getting a little closer now. Yeah, dude, that thing looked freaking nuts on the on the drone. Unbelievable. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go, guys. We are approaching. <coughs> I can't believe we're doing this. Dude, this is like so exciting. This is very exciting, but I'm also worried. Oh, a bunny! Hi, bunny. Dude, that could be like a like a nuclear bunny. The one thing I'm worried about right now, one is the military. Two is the papa. <laughs> papa. I know, right? Like well, it's completely barbed wire, bro. Well, that side, but You say this as a I, I mean I see speakers up there. I see cameras. <laughs> I mean we're just gonna have to take our chances and kinda hope for the best, right? I'm hoping that whatever that door thing leads to is open. This looks insane. This bro. is nuts. This is actually what I expected coming out here. Right? Wow. Look at that thing. What does it say? The... I think it says the Starling. Well, we that is sick. Starling? Yeah. Starlight. The Starlight. Star, Starlight. Yeah, Starlight. So people have been here. I guess so. Tagged up a little bit. Yeah. I mean, if it's abandoned, it's bound to have been explored at one so, point in time, right? What if we that wide open door right there? Probably, yeah. That's Shall so we cool. uh, get a closer look? Yeah, sure. Let's come up a little bit. I'm gonna go check over here. Yeah, go see if that door's open, actually. I'm hoping it is. 
Be careful because you might find ISIS in there. Just letting you know. <sighs> he has no idea why I just said that, but I'll let him figure it out. <laughs> oh, so much spider webs. Whoa. Oh my god. Dude, that is freaking insane. Look at that. It's even cooler from here. Just being like literally right up next to it is freaking wild. This is nuts. Look how gigantic these doors are. Yeah, this was definitely a missile silo, like a hundred percent. There's absolute, oh my God, I thought I thought it was a snake for a second. Uh, kind of on edge, kind of excited, but kind of on edge at the same time. Yeah? It's open. Oh, baby. Oh man. Hang on, I'm just gonna take a photo here. Oh, there's a fucking rattlesnake in there. Oh my god. Oh, I'm not even fucking joking, bro. I literally just, I walked right by it. It's not moving or anything. Holy crap. Is it dead? Oh, I don't know. Go check the door. Oh my god. I don't want to check the door. Do you want to check the door? <laughs> Holy it's fuck. Open. That's what I was trying to... ah, That scared the in? shit out of me. Yeah, we're definitely going in. I just need a second. Yeah, take your time. Oh my god. Did you hear me scream? Oh, I heard you scream. Oh, it's a big mother. It's big. I want to go see it. You want to see it? Yeah. Okay. Now I really have to pee. <laughs> okay. So, uh, of course, Jazz wants to see the goddamn rattlesnake. I sent, I sent the uh, <laughs> video to my girlfriend of like what this place looks like. You know? Yeah. She goes, "Babe, you're not going in there, are you?" And I go, "Of course I am." <laughs> What do you think now? this is? Yeah, Careful, because it might have actually moved at this point. Okay. Where did you see it? Um, it's okay, so you see where that corner yeah. right there is? It's literally right, like wrapped kind of almost around the, uh, the metal thing. Let's try not to get too close. You recording? I'm recording. Alright guys, Angelo has footage of something that he wants to film me. Uh, dude, I didn't even record it. I ran so fucking fast. Alright, right, we gotta see this. I kind of don't want to go that close, to be honest with you. It's on the other side it's, of it? Uh, no, it's like literally like right there. I don't know if you can tell from here, but... You can still see it? You know what? I have an idea. Oh, oh, oh my god, you scared the shit out of me. There, you can see it. Right there. Oh you see my it? god, yeah. Hang on, let it focus. It's not even like moving or anything. Come on, focus. There we go. Yeah, holy yeah, you cow, can see it's it. massive. Oh, it's a big boy. Wait, where exactly is that? It's literally like under the the metal thing. Oh, okay. You see it? Here's this. I'm gonna try to get a little closer. Yeah. Best of luck, bro. Here's this. I'm gonna put this. Uh, let me just put this away. Yeah. All right. Oh, you can. Bother. All right. Well, the only one thing I'm worried now is if it's in here. All right, here we go. Oh right. man, this is gonna be crazy. Uh, we're doing it. Yeah. Let's, let's just be. Uh, here, let's just be cautious. Okay. <laughs> huh? I don't know. People, rattlesnakes. Hello, is anybody in here? There's probably some people. Whoa! Oh my god, what's wrong? What's wrong? It's covered up the <laughs> What? What's in there? Oh, something's fucking running up the stairs, some fing rodent or something. Holy f dude. It might be a snake, I'm dead. Oh man. Okay, so I guess we're not going in there? No, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> Holy f dude. Okay, guys, um. <laughs> This is just taking a full 100. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna be honest. We thought we were gonna go in there. I opened the door and I, we start going down the stairs and all we see is something oh, slithering up the stairs really fast. We just saw a rattlesnake over there. Yeah, f this. Let's get out of here. Yeah, bro, I'm not playing the oh, this trick, bro. But... Good. If you guys wanna see the rattlesnake... Gracious. I'll get a little close up. Bro, don't worry about it, man. I have it on my camcorder. <laughs> Oh man, he's making. I don't know. I can't tell from here, man. You see it? Did it move? Holy crap, dude! You were right next to him, weren't you? Oh, dude! I literally was like standing right there. It must be like taking a nap or something, because he didn't even move. He's right there, right behind the metal thing, right there. Yeah, so I'm not, I'm not gonna play with that. No, no. Let's get out of here. As much as I would love to do this, like, I don't want to play with that. Yeah, this is cool to see, but... I hope you guys understand, I'm sorry. F that. God knows what's in there. God knows if th that just ends up like a big hole. He knows. So what was the intent? Um, unsolved mystery, I think. Oh, okay. Well, it's gonna remain unsolved now. Yeah, apparently. Oh my god. Or we would have ended up being the unsolved mystery at this bro, point. If we, get, if we get bit by a rattlesnake out here, 
Dude, we are like what pretty are far do? from just about anywhere. What are we gonna do? Oh man, just keep your eyes peeled too. Yeah, yeah, for real. Now I'm like super nervous. <laughs> yeah, I'm like. Oh. That was actually the first time I've ever seen a rattlesnake. What about you? Yeah. Did you hear it? No, no, dude, it didn't move. It might have been sleeping. It might have been sleeping. So the only way. Sorry, I'm just. Whoa! Oh, oh my god! Oh man! Oh, god, the military. <laughs> Oh, I think my camera might have stopped recording because you made me. All I heard was the boats like move like crazy. Oh my god! And all I see is this, like in the air, like this. Oh no! Okay, okay, let's slow down for a second. Holy! Go on. Oh my god! This is not good for the heart. Yeah. I wanna, I wanna talk about this for a second. What? A lot of people say that there's a lot of people that go missing out in the desert. Yeah, the I wonder why. And now, <coughs> when you really think about it though, if we get bit by <coughs> bro, I don't even think I'd have the energy to get back to the car. No. Drive to the hospital, no way. Definitely not. Yeah, that. Not worth it. <sighs> huh? I don't care about it. Well, I don't give a shit about a ticket, man. I'm just keeping the lights on just to make sure we, uh, we can see, ever, see whatever is out here. Bro, three of them in one shot? Remember how I told you when my girlfriend was like, you're not going down there? <laughs> she fucking I'm she fucking had us, bro. What was that? Yeah. Oh my god, there's something moving. Let's go! Just run, 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 There's something fucking moving in there, I'm telling you, bro. Come on, come on. I just don't want to Oh my god. Dude, that's four. Four of them. Mother They're fucking everywhere. No, no. Oh. Holy moly. Oh. Oh, stupid. Huh? Yeah. Holy f bro, fucking four of them? Yeah. Listen, bro. I don't know what the last one was. I didn't see it, but it was moving pretty fucking quick in those bushes. Holy crap, man. That place is completely infested. Oh. So if you guys know where this place is, or end up figuring it out because I know some of you are crazy enough like us be very careful or just don't even bother going at all oh my god all right we gotta get the fuck out of here holy all right guys so a little bit of context as to uh, what happened there what we saw there what we experienced there so we had actually driven that day three hours from Albuquerque all the way to Roswell decided to grab some dinner so we ended up running Randonautica and it Ended up taking us to this, as you guys saw, was an abandoned missile silo. I did a little bit of research, and as it turns out, it was an Atlas F missile silo. It had um, basically no longer been in use for many, many years, and obviously became abandoned. There was actually 10 floors down into this bunker, and um, it probably would have been pretty exciting to be able to explore it, to be honest with you. But um, the reason why we didn't, as you guys saw, was that this location in particular was completely infested with rattlesnakes. I've never encountered a rattlesnake. I don't think I've ever really encountered too many snakes in general uh, out in the wild. Here in Canada, we do have snakes, but they're usually like little garden snakes, like tiny, tiny little ones, like pretty much harmless. But yeah, as you guys can see, uh, what I didn't realize was the first time walking up to it, if you look in the bottom right corner of this, you will see that the rattlesnake was there. <laughs> and the fact that I actually stood literally about two feet away from it is crazy because you know had that thing whether it was sleeping or whatever um had it noticed me it probably would have bitten me and probably wouldn't have ended well but yeah so basically what's interesting is that when i flew the drone over it i didn't even see it on the drone because i the screen is literally about this big it was really really sunny so i just obviously didn't notice it but if you look close enough in the drone footage you can actually see the snake hanging down in into the missile silo which is absolutely insane um so the only thing that i saw was obviously the tail of it the second time i kind of came around it i wasn't even recording and i just saw it my brain processed it really really quickly and i'm like holy crap that's a rattlesnake and i hightailed it out of there when jazz and i went down into the stairwell of the actual bunker 
Jazz is like 95% sure that he saw a rattlesnake as well coming up the stairs, which is crazy. Um, he wasn't like 100% sure, so he didn't really know whether it was like some type of rodent or if it was a snake, but he saw it moving really, really quickly and he's like 95% sure that the thing was a freaking rattlesnake. When he reviews his footage, I'm sure we'll know whether it was or wasn't. Then as we're walking up the driveway, again, he sees one kind of like going like this in the, in the bushes. And then again, we hear something crawling through the bushes on the right side. I'm pretty sure I saw something in the grass, and that's kind of why I freaked out the very last time. And I'm like, yo, we just got to get the hell out of here. Um, but yeah, that first experience was insane, like absolutely crazy. I've never experienced anything like that in my life. And just knowing that I literally came this close to potentially dying um, is insane. And... Uh, is what it is. We did survive and, and make it out of there. Obviously, I am back home now in Canada. Um, but yeah, the rest of these experiences are just as insane. I don't think they include more rattlesnakes, hopefully. If you guys notice one, let me know down in the comments below. But yeah, let me tell you after that, I'm having uh, some nightmares about snakes. But uh, enjoy the rest of this video. I don't know if you guys heard that on the camera, but... Oh, it's a little cat. What the heck? Okay. That's kind of a, a funny thing to find. Hello. Sorry, I don't want to blind you. Oh, it's literally a little black cat. Hi, baby. What you doing out here? Oh, he's gonna run away. Hey, I'm not gonna hurt ya. What are you doing? Come here. Come over here. <laughs> There's literally a, a little black cat under there. Oh, he's cute. Come here. What? Oh, I think he's afraid. Okay, well, <laughs> I knew I was hearing something. I want to see if I can get close to him. <gasps> now all of a sudden I'm distracted. What is that noise? What is going on right now? Bro, there's literally a cat under the car or something. Yeah. There's a cat literally under the car. Is it I don't know. Okay, remember when we were like sitting here? Yeah. Where is it? I don't know. Is it right? No, no, dude, they're cats. Where is it? I can't even see it though. Take the screen out. It's literally like under the car. Bro. You want to know what I think just happened? What? I think a cat crawled into the like the bottom part of the car. What the f Yeah. What the hell? Okay, so I was setting up the camera because I was going to do like a, I was going to say something, but yeah. okay, so there was a black cat over there, and I kid you not, I heard another one from down there somewhere, and now I'm hearing one Bro, I thought it was under you. the f***ing car. I was sitting in the here. car, just on my Hold phone. this for a sec. And all I heard was meow. It's me, right? Meow. I know. He might actually be stuck under the f***ing car. How come I don't hear it anymore, though? I don't know. Maybe it was just near the car? What if it's in the car? Okay, so remember when I was like standing out here? Yeah. And I'm like, I literally heard something rattling from the car. That's why I'm like kind of concerned that there's literally a cat stuck in the car right now. 
Well, that's going to be a weird insurance claim. Oh, no way. What? What? Oh, okay, never mind. I thought, <laughs> I, thought I saw something. Don't scare me. Like a little fucking Poor kitty. Yeah. What if it's in the car? I have no idea. Bro, if there's a cat inside the car, that's going to be hilarious right now. <laughs> I'm, I'm taking it home. <laughs> Lola has a new buddy. Oh my god, that is so funny. Hello, kitty. Dude, it literally sounded like it was coming from under the car. Unless Here, hold this for a second. Let me see something. Around. That was not part of the plan. <laughs> idea, sorry. Oh my god. I don't think it's under anymore. I don't know. Under Unless it was just it's walking under. around. I have no idea. Nah, if, definitely if it was underground, we'd see it. Yeah, it must have been just like walking oh, really. Like Might be. Might just be. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, have fun up there, I guess, then. Yeah, I don't know what that was all about, but. Okay. Weird. Very. <laughs> like, I swear I heard it coming from under the car, unless it was like a ghost cat or something, but, uh, yeah, guys, um, so we are somewhere in the middle of nowhere. Randonautica has literally taken us about, I want to say, like, 40 minutes out of Roswell. So I want to talk about a, a little bit about what happened while we were at that abandoned missile silo that ran and Autica took us to. So, yeah, rattlesnakes. There were uh, probably about three to four of them, all in a span of literally 10 minutes. So what happened was, this is actually really freaking scary because I literally did not notice how close, we're talking literally within two feet of me standing right next to a rattlesnake. Um, so yeah, we literally came very, very close to death today. Where is it? Meow. Yeah. Bro, I'm telling you, there's literally a cat here somewhere. Okay, um, I don't know what the hell's going on here, but <laughs> I keep hearing a cat meowing. I don't know exactly where the hell it is, um, apart from the one we saw down there. So, apart from that, um, I did run another point. We started kind of like in the middle of nowhere. It has brought me here. I don't even know what this is. There's literally a bunch of these random buildings around here. They kind of look like historic buildings. I'll probably uh, see. I actually want to know what the heck these things are. Let's see. So, well, I can't check right now because Google still has my point saved. Um, and it literally says it's at one of the buildings around here. We're very close to it. It actually looks like it's that one. Um, so let's take a walk over there and see exactly what we find. I would also like to know exactly where this cat is hiding. Because it honestly sounds like it's literally in our car at this point. <laughs> Which is uh, kind of crazy. I don't know. That's weird. But okay. So yeah. This uh, Randonautica has decided to take us to this building. I don't know what this building is. We are getting closer and closer to it. Uh, it's already kind of late. Which is unfortunate that the sun is going down much earlier and uh, rumor has it that apparently back home it's already getting pretty cold also I kind of forgot I'm telling you I can't figure out where the hell it is it might actually be far down there somewhere oh there it is Oh, there's a cat right under the car now. 
Is your baby under there? Oh, there it is. I told you. I see it. Oh, it's, it went into the wheel. <sighs> Come look. Why are you hiding in there? <laughs> Dude, it's in the wheel well. There's a little kitten right in the wheel well. Really? I kid you not. I saw him go in there. See it? There he is. Look. He's right there. There's the mama. Yeah, I know. That's why the mom came. He's in there. I literally saw him move. How the hell did he get up there? He came down and then he went back in. It's a kitten? Yeah. It's literally a little kitten. I saw. I literally just saw him move in there. This is the weirdest Randonautica adventure ever. <laughs> <laughs> well, she'll she'll probably come back. It's tiny, like I literally saw it. I, I even saw it on the camera too. I knew I wasn't going crazy. I don't know about that. <sighs> Whatever. I'm trying to get to my point here. <laughs> so, uh, as I was trying to say, my intention was actually conspiracy. Um, I personally really love that one just because I'm very interested in conspiracies. Um, so I'm kind of hoping we'll find something cool. I don't know, maybe the buildings are related to conspiracy somehow, but let's get a little closer to this building and, uh, and we'll find out. Did you find it? <laughs> he's in there. I know for sure he's in there. He's got to leave before we, uh, <laughs> oh my God, that scared the crap out of me. <laughs> he's got to get out of there before we, oh, Fort Stanton Museum and Visitor Center. Cool. I knew it kind of looked like some, something historic. Wasn't quite sure, but I don't know what the heck he's doing over there. Oh, what the hell? Uh, what is that noise? I swear I'm nervous now because of rattlesnakes. That's weird. <laughs> What the heck is this? Bro! Did you find the, uh, the cat? Huh? I'm telling you, he's up there. He's literally, like, in the suspension right now. I found something. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. The mom keeps coming to, to get the baby. He came down, and then, like, he just jumped right back in for some reason. He's, uh, apparently he likes the Traverse. <laughs> I know, right? Kitty. I guess we'll, uh, deal with this in a second. Can you see it? No. It's definitely in there, because I can, you can hear him now once in a while. Are we sure it's not in the car? No, I'm positive it's not in the car because I saw him literally jump up into the uh, the wheel on the passenger side. Uh, so Hello. On, get out. You gotta leave, man. Yeah, no. At some point, if we if we walk away, the mom will come back and he'll probably jump back down. Think so? Yeah, I think he's just scared. Definitely in there though. It was cute too. It was literally tiny. Minuscule. Yeah. And he's yes. like he's like hiding up in there. Yeah, I'm trying to see what my lens. You won't be able to see him probably. Well no, I'm using my camera to see. Baby. Hello. Meet me. Well, let's just leave it alone for a little bit and hopefully he'll come out. I'm trying to So Angel's doing his point. I'm in, I'm inside the car watching a tennis game. Because <laughs> uh, long story, but I gotta support my man. Oh, there you hear it. There. Right. I can't even focus on the tennis game because all you. <laughs> yeah, he'll come down eventually. He's definitely in there though. Whatever. I could probably like slide down under there after and get it. I'll go talk to the mom. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Let the let the mom know that you know baby's gotta leave. So, what is this exactly? <laughs> um, got very distracted. There's just a lot happening today. Mm 
can hear something in here. Little baby, I guess. You can definitely hear it. He's in there. Why won't you leave, man? What's going on? There's a baby, it's so cute. Yeah, I know, this one's cute too. Oh, I love it. Oh, man. Mew. Awesome. Now they're going away. We gotta reunite them. I know, he's in there. I just, I, he won't come down for some You're reason. You're still the This is more important. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> this is actually, uh... <laughs> I refused to leave until... Dude, it was so small. I know. The other baby. He'll come down eventually. I hope so. Yeah, he has to. Would it be better if I just sat in the car then and let the mom just come here? As if like... Probably. There's something in here. Well, I'm vlogging. This is his point. I don't want to ruin this. Go to Angela's channel if you want to see this. I do see that he has a... Uh... You playing with toys again, Angela? <laughs> Not intentionally. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. Yeah, I'm sure if we if we walk away, he'll come down, cause yeah. cause the mom will come. So there's like this thing is ripped. Oh, there's something inside of it. Oh, shit. totally didn't mean to do that, but it looked like it was already done. Uh, <laughs> There's a bunch of weird stuff in here, dude. Yeah? Yeah. I'm still recording, though, but don't spoil it for me. Alright. I'll tell you guys in a second. Yeah. So, I'm assuming... Let's just walk away, and let's see if Mama comes back. Well, I just tried walking over there. The mom just kept going with the baby. Well, yeah, that's because I'm over here, too, right? So, the mom is afraid of me, and I'm assuming so is the kitten. So, we're gonna... You could stay in the car. I'll walk away. I just want to make sure they get out of there before we start leaving, because we don't want to hurt it, right? Alright guys, uh, <laughs> this just turned into something totally funny. Alright guys, back to this uh, Randonautica video. Um, this has been a very weird, strange chain of events, uh, <laughs> considering that we now have a cat literally stuck inside of the car somewhere in the undercarriage. We have absolutely no idea where the heck it is. But, back to this, um, we do have some strange stuff. Looks like how we plan to put men on the moon. Oh, it, uh, this is from 1964. Wow. Um, oh, what the heck? There's literally something written on it. Looks like it says they always lie. Weird. There's like a whole bunch of weird stuff in here. So we got this. I don't know what this is exactly. It does say the president and premier, prince and emperor march bareheaded to the funeral. And for some reason the word funeral is literally circled to key two names. What? What funeral? What the heck are they talking about? And then we have this. This is literally like, it's like a fold out of a thing. For some reason the word heroes here is like X'd out. Um, that is very strange. Just trying to figure out a spot I could put this flashlight so it doesn't roll away. <clears throat> and then we have this picture. For some reason, there's like some people in the window that are circled. Actually, this guy's circled too. I don't know if you guys can see that. And then we 
have something that says the last last full measure and we have this dude crossed out I'm pretty sure it's JFK yeah it's literally John Fitzgerald Kennedy and for some reason the date of his death is actually circled there that is weird I don't understand oh okay it's literally a picture of the whole family and his eyes are X'd out that is weird we do have some photos I don't know what this is it's like a foot and like a paper bag let me have that written on the back we have this oh and then of course there's something written on the back as well what in the actual hell is going on here Let's see if I can read what that says. There's like a hospital wristband on this guy's arm. What the fuck? See, did it? Got a what looks like a some kind of note. It's a really hard to see. There's like a note. Okay, this is fucking weird. There's so many of it. And then we have the Titanic. <laughs> it says lies. Uh, another one. So I kind of get what one of them is. Oh, this one is different. It's actually why I'm like looking at the picture. I can tell. Uh, I think it's different. So I, I'm like pretty sure this one is not the Titanic, but the sister ship. I can't remember the name of the sister ship. Um, if you guys happen to know the name of it, let me know down in the comments below. But there is a conspiracy behind a lot of this I'm trying to figure out what this one is the foot that is really weird but okay that is weird hey jazz Yo. do you know the conspiracy of the titanic do you know the conspiracy of the titanic Come check this out. Check these out. I'd love to if you didn't use the sun as your light camera. Like, <laughs> Lies. Here, let me help you out with that. Better? How about now? Better? I hate this guy. <laughs> Orthodontists hate this guy. <laughs> lies, 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 lies. Is this the Titanic? So, there is a conspiracy behind the Titanic. I probably mentioned it before when we actually went to the... So, I went to the Titanic Cemetery, where they actually buried a uh, majority of the people, the, the bodies that they found, or not even all the bodies, actually, but... Um, there is a conspiracy that they sunk the sister ship instead of the actual titanic some people have said it was for an insurance claim other people have said that it was because uh there was a lot of very prominent people who were supposed to make a very important vote at the time and they wanted to kill them, get rid of them um yeah or that i don't know it's a pretty extensive conspiracy and there's been like some a lot of information that have kind of like debunked it then there's also this stuff Zapatos. Can I read that? Yeah. I can try.
I haven't heard that uh, cat meow in a while. I told you, I think it's gone. I don't think so. C did it. Yeah. Strange. And then there's, uh, then we got some JFK over here. Some more JFK. Which I mean, there is a conspiracy tie. Oh yeah, by the way, my intent was conspiracy. So. Nail on the head with that one. Right? I would say. Mm -hmm. Um, alright. Man, yeah, we're gonna try and move along here. This place is actually really cool. Yeah, for what it's worth, it's, it's freaking massive, but uh, I don't really have time to explore. We're literally like three and a half hours away from Albuquerque, so we're gonna probably head back there. And our hotel. Yeah, I'll probably do like one more intent, and uh, we'll probably try one more of his first and uh, go from there. So I'll see you guys soon. We're gonna try and save this cat, hopefully. All right, guys, so uh, something really strange just happened. Um, apart from our experience that we just had on Jazz's channel, uh, if you guys want to see what happened, you definitely got to go to his channel. Um, something else also happened that's kind of included in that, I guess you could say, which we'll probably talk about after this, but you guys will actually probably see after this. Really f creepy stuff. I've never experienced anything like this before. Um, yeah, it's been a uh, it's been a wonderful day though, right? Running from rattlesnakes and uh, finding weird stuff. I mean, the last stuff that I just found was totally freaking weird. Yeah, I didn't want to talk about it. Uh, yeah, I kind of figured out the thing that I really wasn't. Okay, <laughs> I kind of figured out something that I didn't realize in the first uh, experience before, not in the first one, but the one just before this. Um, but I kind of don't want to give it away just yet, so I'm going to just let you guys try and figure it out. It was a set of photos. There was like a foot and like an arm and stuff. I kind of figured it out, um, but I just want to kind of see if you guys can figure it out. So if you do, let me know down in the comments below. The other weird thing that happened is uh, we ran the intent second chance. Um, I can't remember the person's name. Um, we'll figure it out after, and then I'll put your name on the screen. But uh, thank you for providing that intent to us. And it actually brought us back to somewhere we were earlier yep. which is really strange so we stopped off at this random gas station driving to roswell and uh, we noticed that there was an abandoned building back there so we went in explored it checked it out that was this morning by the way yeah nothing too crazy or out of the ordinary just literally an abandoned building we think it was like an old water department building or something like that and uh yeah there's there's still quite a bit of stuff left in there but yeah all of a sudden uh the app wants us to go back in there, so uh, I don't really know why, um, but I guess we will go and check it out, maybe see if anything's changed. Everything deserves a second chance. Yeah, not to mention that when we first got here, we noticed that there was a car parked right in front, and he kind of drove away. Yeah, I got I, that on camera. Yeah, I didn't have my camera. My camera was still in the bag, but Jazz actually filmed that. It's on his vlog channel if you want to see that. Um, but yeah, that was kind of strange. So very, bro. Like, dude, was the guy in the house? Like, so there was a driver. Well, it was a minivan, so I couldn't really like tell. Yeah. But there was someone driving, and then all I seen was like someone jog around the building, oh, and right. then got in like the back seat, not even in the passenger, the back seat. That was weird. Yeah, because I, I went, went to the washroom because drank a lot of water because it's really hot here during the day yeah <laughs> and then the night is absolutely free i'm literally shaking Dude, right? i like, see it on camera it's so breezy and uh it, it is actually like really cold it's like about an hour ago on the thing it was showing us 18 degrees celsius um i don't even know what that is in fahrenheit i think it's like 55 it's 9 60 something like that 30? so it's actually probably even colder now it's annoying as all hell but uh all right let's uh Go. I also want to reiterate how dirty your hoodie is. Well, I can't imagine. <laughs> yeah, we were trying to save a cat from under the car. Yeah. The cat finally left. <laughs> um, very eventful vlog. Yeah, it was very eventful. We were like, come on, man. Just get out of there. I mean, we don't want to hurt the damn yeah. kitty. So we literally waited. <laughs> That's for what he like said. Probably about an hour. Yeah. For the little guy to leave. I love the name of the city, Vaughn. It's just comes off the mouth nicely. I know, right? It's kind of funny because there's actually a city near me back home that's also Vaughn. But I oh, think really? there's an extra A in there. Mm. For some odd reason. I don't know. Beware of raddies. Of what? Raddies. 
Shut your mouth. Ratle snack is. Make me. <laughs> Doesn't look like it's changed much, but remember, some people could take residence to this. him jog from here? I just, all I saw was him come from around the fence yeah. and then hopped in the van because it was right in front of it. <sighs> but let's go check. I remember I went in here because I was picking up the flags. I didn't want the flags to be on the, yeah, the flags are up now. Always, wait, Angelo, that door was open earlier, right? What door? That one right there. I, I think, I can't remember. I could be losing it because we've been to tons of abandoned buildings lately, but yeah. I feel like that was open. Huh. Sorry, I'm just looking around the floor. I don't think there's any right things. Famous last words. <laughs> I don't see anything. Hello, is anybody home? What happened? Like, oh, oh, what if the snake's on the roof? <laughs> you stay there. <laughs> Screw you. Oh yeah, there's a stop sign inside the room. It's so funny. You see it on the window? Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> there's a legit so stop funny. sign. I know. Tell me I stir fire. It's burning up in my head. Hello. Hello. Are you in there? Anybody home? Whoa, 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 whoa! Did you not hear that? What? 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 It sounded like, it sounded like metal creaking. Swear on everything, bro. What are you gonna do? Clean them? You should clean your back with that. <laughs> okay, I'll stab <laughs> them. I don't know. It's the best. The Hold best on. Let me go check around the building. Okay. If we're gonna do this, we better yeah. make sure that. Bro, it, cause I stepped on that metal and it didn't make a sound, but it sounded like I wonder if your camera picked that up. Oh, here we go. Oh yeah, I think that's the police department straight ahead. I think so. I mean, they even have a police department here? <laughs> like... Oh wait, what does that say up there? Oh, elder. It's the city elders that stay here. Oh, remember. Remember when we were filming earlier, when we were here, yeah. I said I saw someone. Someone in really- here? Remember I said I saw someone through the window when we were in that belt oh, building. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Someone really could be staying around here. It's possible, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's that? Uh, it's gonna be just, uh, some trash or something. Ugh, I'm getting the heebie-jeebies, man. I'm getting the heebie bro. I might even stick there. <laughs> oh man. Yo, I swear to God, bro. Everywhere I go, it doesn't matter where I go now, I'm terrified of rattlesnakes. Oh, dude, like it's just non stop. We, like we stopped at that gas station earlier, <laughs> and like I I think someone took something off the rack and it yeah. made a sound, and I went like this. <laughs> I think some people would call that PTSD. Ah, yeah, it's up there. <sighs> Are you going to go in here? I really did not appreciate that today. Uh, it, it threw us off our gate. Because normally we're like, no f given, you know, kind of just doing our thing. Well, at least I am. You, you jump at the sight of a spricket, so. I, I do, all right. <laughs> and I embrace it. Hello, anybody home? Hello. What the hell was that? The f was that? Like a, Excuse my French. That's like a beep or something. Yeah. Right? Oh shit, is there like an alarm? No way. There's no way. This place is literally cold. You think the <laughs> You think the power still works in here? Can you imagine? There's Dude, no lights. I've, <laughs> I've literally had that happen before. I've been in an abandoned houses. The house was literally shifting and the whole thing was just cracked and falling apart and completely decrepit. We flipped the light switch it and worked. it turned on. That's insane. Like, There's no way. Me and Ben were at a church recently where I turned the light on. Oh yeah? It was it completely bent. Yeah, it was insane. This place is crazy. Yeah. Where's that little cute toy that was here earlier? 
Oh, I just stepped on a nail. Oh. Was it, where was it? It was like right here. This cute little. Uh, remember that cute little toy? I was like, that's. Oh, yeah. Ow! I just stepped on it again. Careful, oh, there's like nails in there. That's I stepped on it twice. Um, yeah, I hear right, something. Isn't it here? Um, yeah, that's what I'm looking for. That's what I remember. A little pouch. What is that? Oh, sorry, bubble wrap. Wait, what is that? What are you looking at? That the white yellow thing. Oh yeah, that's kind of weird. Hola, soy Dora. Hello. What's up? What am I looking at? Sorry, I can't see because of the light. What What am I looking at? I really can't see. It says C three. Oh, C three. Oh my God, C three. Wait a second. Was that here earlier? Did we miss it? I don't. All right, now we have to go rewatch that footage because. Unless, oh my god, Angelo, the air tag. Did you tell them? No, I was gonna explain, but um, oh. yeah, we went to a point uh, just before this, not too far away from here, and uh, Jazz got a notification. I don't really know how it works, but apparently, if somebody's like, what, what is it, like a security thing? You air tag. It's a, it's a tracker. That that part I understand, but you said there's a security feature. Yes. So that... after a couple hours, if someone's air tag is with you, near you, within 30 feet. What the fuck was that? Hello? You're whistling. Oh hell no. Okay, let's. The, get out of here. Okay. Some white. Yep, yep. Uh, close the door behind me. Sorry. Okay. What the hell is going on? There's definitely someone here or near here. Yeah. You know what? Let's just go back to the car. Okay. So, C3. Okay. So, once again, I just want I'll, I'll reiterate this for you guys. So, there's a security measure after a couple hours if if a air tag is with you, like near you or whatever, even if it's your friends, it's a security measure that Apple has that it turns on, it lets you know. It just says, hey, there's an air tag with you. Really weird thing though, it, it shows you the map of where it's been and like everywhere, you know, everything. It was with us from Albuquerque to Roswell to everywhere in between in the mountains and everything. Keep in mind, Albuquerque and Roswell is what, like three and a half hours? Just about, yeah. And then everything in between. So it was with us for over 12 hours today. Dude, like what the Just saying, that's a little weird. So C3 on shoes, again, and it kind of makes sense now because the whole yeah. second chance, and also if we're talking uh, the air tag thing, it all makes sense. Yeah. It's all coming together. But who, who? I don't know, man. Or and what? Like I, like yo, if you're gonna fucking try and give me clues to something, like give me a little bit more, man. Like. Angela? What? 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 Just saw a flash. From the house? Fr from the window. Oh, you really told him. I did. Them. Okay. Let's, uh, let's get out of here. Let's at least get her out of the city, please. Yeah, yeah. Vaughn, you've given me enough. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Oh my god. Be careful, be careful. Go, 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 just go, go, go. I don't want to find out, bro. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, sorry, sorry. I forgot. Yeah, yeah sorry, sorry. Angel? Yeah. Uh, lockbox. CJNG. Oh, shit. Again. Hello? 
Allah. What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new Randonautica adventure. So, um, we've come across this, uh, basically a ghost town. If you listen very closely. You hear that? Because I don't. Apart from Jazz <laughs> trying to swat away mosquitoes, there is literally not even a single sound. We're in basically the middle of nowhere, like literally in some sort of valley, which looks absolutely incredible. But, but look what we have. port a -pot. Yes. That's the, uh, the best find we've made all week. Um, so yeah, uh, we've been basically playing all week and this is pretty much the final episode. And uh, basically my point that was generated by Jazz, because we're playing a fun game where I generate a point for him, he generates one for me. I don't mm -hmm. even know what the intent is, but it is literally down that way. Um, I actually just flew the drone in there and it does look like there is stuff there. There are structures. Uh, I don't want to say what it is because I want to, you know, keep up the suspense and the anticipation. Um, but yeah, it is leading us in that direction directly towards those pieces of equipment. And just take a look at this. Yeah. We have some distance to cover. Yeah, we got a little bit of a walk. And so. we have to be back before 8 p.m. Yes, there is a specific reason why. Um, something that Jazz found in his video that indicates as to why we can't stay here past 8 p.m. What time is it now, anyways? Um, it is 6.56. Oh, dear good. Yeah. Um, so we literally have one hour, and then we got to get the hell out of here. But, uh... All right, guys, I hope you are uh, excited and ready for this episode um go smash the like button go and follow jazz he's going to help me film this experience um smack the shit out of you. i know they're like everywhere they're so know, bad man. like we should we i wish we had deep but unfortunately i forgot to sponsor us deep is what it is but uh yeah let's uh head on over there and uh see if we find anything cool okay Well, I can't. I'll ruin the quality of the video. Yeah, that's true. Okay, Jazz, don't keep up. <laughs> I'm thinking of you, man. Oh my god. What Can you just lock thinking? the car? Huh? Can you just please lock the car? Yeah. Where's the key? I just want to reiterate. We tried taking the car up here. You'll see why we couldn't. Yeah, we literally like pulled in, and um, we didn't quite get stuck, but I was like. Imagine I really don't know if we should do here. this, right? Yeah, exactly. We're uh, we're pretty screwed. <laughs> like, yes, we have a great car, but like, look at this. Yeah. So One tiny rock, it's over. I think we definitely need to keep our eyes open because after what happened yesterday. What happened yesterday? You don't remember what happened yesterday? No, I wanted you to tell me. It was a video. Yeah. That's what happened. So, yesterday. if you haven't seen yesterday's video, we did run into some. We made some friends. I'll just leave it at that. And uh, if you want to know who those friends were, what their names were, go watch that video. Yeah, because they were wearing names. I just said, hi, yeah. my name is yeah. Geraldine. Exactly. So, Geraldine? What? <laughs> I think it's a beautiful name. Oh, yeah, I think we got right about here. Yeah. We literally had to turn around. The traverse was like, no, thank you. Yeah. I mean... And we were even in mountain mode. We, we, we could have done it. We literally could have done it. I just really didn't want to take the chance. Um, we did buy the insurance, but... Okay, Angelo, but imagine... Remember, we can't be here past 8. True. And imagine something happens to us up here. True. We have to stay the night here, because... Well, is AAA going to come up here? I have no idea. I mean, I would hope so. Otherwise, I'm going to call the rental car company and be like, Bro, I'm stuck here. <laughs> we'll call an Uber. They'll come bring us home, and... Uh, I'm really getting sick Back of these bugs. The what, the mosquitoes? Yeah. I know, they're so bad. They're evil. Evil bastards. Hashtag end all mosquitoes. I'm sorry guys if it's a little bumpy. I just, when I walk, I have to stare at the ground now. Check this out. This is, uh, this is pretty cool. There's some ruins there. Um, we got some more ruins there. Wanna check them out? Oh, you can, yeah. Yeah. I'm not going past. No. no. I, I really have a, a rush. If you thought I was paranoid before, you guys were. Yeah, there. I don't blame you. It's kind of funny because, so I literally got within about two feet of a rattlesnake and we're trying to avoid uh, the same scenario happening. So I'm going to be extremely cautious. I'll be ready to piss on you if anything. Yeah. P wait, what? I'm ready to piss on you. That's a thing. You told me. 
Oh yeah, I did tell you. Yeah. Alright, I'm not gonna go too far in, cause... F that. <laughs> but, it's what it is, I suppose. Looks kinda cool. Clearly this stuff's been abandoned for like, a long ass time. I'd say. Yeah, it's um, complete this is ruins. The dinosaur era? <laughs> the dinosaur era? Look, there's a can. A can? What a great discovery! You wanna play the guessing game? What's the guessing what game? What kind of can it is? Um, I'm saying Diet Coke. Okay. What are you gonna say? I'm gonna say Canada Dry. What is it? Fanta? It's a regular Coke. Oh shit, we were both wrong. You were close though. You were close. What is that? A red glowing thing right there. Yeah, wanna hold that for a sec? Yeah. Be careful, bro. You're literally in rattle territory. Coyote Peterson over here. Just saw something move in there. <laughs> I don't know if it was a snake or... Well, we did read that they like rocks. And this, my friend, is a large rock. What? Oh. Oh, shit. Bro. I'm sorry I'm moving so much of these bugs. Bro. She's literally been like decapitated. What is inside of her? It's like a that was a really weird thing to say. I don't know. Oh, f off mosquitoes. God, what is that? Looks like a mulch. That's really weird. I've never seen a doll like maybe a blue doll. With that. Well, think about it. Okay, we're just gonna maybe just leave her right there. I can't always tell you what our intent was. I heard it, uh, almost like what sounded like a vehicle. What? <sighs> vehicle schmeeple. Vehicle schmeeple. So I'm hoping we don't have to go too far in. Um, is it like just there? It didn't look too far when I threw the drone. By London. Uh, keeping my eyes open. For you know, Jeepers. friends with wow, that looks so tackles. cool. Oh, look at that! Oh my god, what? What snake right there? Where? Right in that bush. Can you see it? Yeah, I can't even see it. Yeah, is it rattlesnake? I don't know, it's like a black one. Oh, I literally can't even see it. Was it like a copperhead? I don't know. Oh, please don't say that. Aren't those poisonous? Aren't rattlesnakes poisonous? The copperheads are worse. Oh, really? I think so, yeah. How did we get to it? <sighs> Is it that way? Whoa. That is nuts. Yeah, nuts she is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what is that right there in the grass? I don't know. Are you sure you want to find out? Well, I'm just saying because... What in the grass? Oh, it's just a piece of wood. Sorry. Oh. Okay. Well, we got to check everything. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, can you still see it from here? How big was it? I don't know. It was like kind of skimpy. I, um, I don't have the best vision, so... I mean, you know that. Sun is setting and it's setting quick. Oh boy. We have less than an hour. Okay, we'll try and uh, get there as quickly as we can, I suppose. I'm gonna be the itchiest person on this plane ride home, I swear to God. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm kind of happy we didn't try to drive in. Because <laughs> look at this. What's wrong with it? We wouldn't have made it. I'm kidding, Andrew. Oh my God, <laughs> look at that wasp right there. Oh my God, we're gonna do... Oh yeah, don't they have like uh, those crazy killer bees out here? I don't know. Why is there everything out here that can kill you? How many things have we found that said like, you are not safe here? <laughs> like really? It's, it's We're really just... literally insane at this point. I'm just saying because metal. Yeah. They, they reiterated- Whoa! Shit! What, what, what? What? What did you see? Something moving in there. On God, on God, on God. 
What did you see, though? I don't know. I'm telling you, though, I'm scared. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Was it, like, a furry friend, or a... You wanna go find out? Not really. I'm not playing with death, bro. I told you this. I'll... Oh, there it goes. It's a, it's a freaking rabbit or something. Oh, it ran off. Okay. Well, if the rabbits are around, and they're alive, then uh, we might be okay. Whew. Yeah, well. Oh, we're getting a little closer. Well, I think that's the entrance. <laughs> Oh, God. <sighs> Shit, man, that sun is setting fast. It doesn't help that there's a gigantic mountain. <laughs> like, if we're literally right in front of it. <sighs> oh, my God. Okay. Let's just uh, do a quick uh, visual check over here. I think we're okay. Will you let me know how it is? Yeah. Something there. I'm just looking around right now. Yeah. Ready? See about that. Come on, man, you can do it. What'd you find? A doll. Um. Listen, man, I'm gonna be real honest with you. You can do it, man, just jump. But it's not the thing. If I have a fear, I have a fear. I'm not gonna go in here just because you're telling me it's good. <laughs> <laughs> it is good. Your word means nothing. <laughs> So there's that. Oh. It's probably, it's very similar colors to the other one, so. Probably connect. But the inside is different though. From what I can tell. Those are nice things. What the hell? Okay. Wanna read that? Put the body in the mine. Whoever tras trespasses here will be next. Killian? Well, that kind of correlates a lot to uh, the oh, note no. I found. Kind of quiet, guys, but we're literally just being as careful as possible. <laughs> You're probably not gonna hear a peep from me for the rest of this video because I'm gonna scream. <laughs> so, I'm dead serious. I'm like petrified. So I think we're okay though. Path looks clear for the most part. I kind of just want to get there, see if we find anything. Man. I think we are good. This is the guy who was two feet away from a rattlesnake yesterday, screaming wow. on the top of his lungs. I mean... They didn't even know. <laughs> Your awareness is, is kind of a... It's crazy, because I literally, like, I walked up to the gate thing and didn't realize that it was literally hanging over the edge. Like, I didn't even notice it. And then I checked after, I'm like... Well, I came back all the way around, went up close again, and I saw it. And like I saw the rattle and it 
processed real fast. And I'm like, holy f <laughs> Okay, um, just turn the camera back on because it's not like a metal, something metal just like drops. I'm like, dong, 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 dong. Like, you know, like if you drop a metal. Yeah, yeah, I know. So just uh, saying, what if this Killian guy is here? Or the stuff that I read about, you know? I hope not. This looks like a Call of Duty map. Yeah, I'm just looking around. This is insane. Yeah, this is nuts, dude. Genuinely. I didn't, like, I didn't expect to be doing this today. <laughs> eh, I kind of did. You never know when you're on the Jazz and Angelo adventures. Yeah. Oh, look. It's Cinderella's boot. Try it on, Angelo. Does it fit? I don't think so. so sick. There's a name on the bottom. What does it say? Julie Wright. See that? Julie Wright. Oh, you're crazy. Yeah, this is insane. I literally have shoes in my rocks. And it's, uh, I have rocks in my shoes. Mm. Bro. What is that right there? What? Look straight ahead right there. See that black thing right there? Black thing. You don't see it? Look straight right there. I'll put it on the screen right here. I'm not even sure it will show on the screen again. Uh -huh. Try to zoom in a little bit. Right. Wait, hold on. I'm trying to point it out. Like on the ground? No, it's right next to it. You know what? Just forget it. Let's worry about this. What? What is it? Okay. Is there like some type of secret here that we're not supposed to like know about or something? I mean. Do we run? Uh, Angel? Yeah. Hold on. I thought I just saw some thing or someone like peek around right there. Hello? Um. Angel, you, you know what the note said about yeah. the mine shaft? Yeah. Where yeah. is the mine shaft? I'm assuming close to this because. Yeah, actually, good point. I'm gonna take a little selfie. Yeah, this is uh, this is crazy, guys. Like, hello, hello, hello. Holy cow. Yeah, I think that was like an old furnace or something. This is so cool. That's like, I, that's probably like the, the smokehouse thing. What is it called? The furnace? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I'm assuming it was probably like a grist mill. But, you yeah. can see the moon right now. Dude, that's wild. Uh, be very cautious with the flock. Yeah, for sure. Guys, I've literally never been this nervous about going to abandoned places before. No, like, bro, I would rather come across people. Right? After yesterday, like, <laughs> exploring abandoned places is not the same anymore. We'll never be the same. Not here. Like, this is just... Crazy. Yeah, back in New York and Canada, they don't have those. Yeah. Like, normally, you know, we just... Freaking waltz right in, you know, no f given, just do our thing. All right, um, it is getting a little late. Angela, Angela, Angela. Yeah? Someone's up there. Who, 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 where? Right, 
What are them millers? You saw them? I swear to God, I just saw somebody. Okay, let's just get the f out of here. Okay. Um, I'm telling you, bro. I'm telling you right now, we are not alone here. Yeah. All right. Let's get the f out of here. Yeah. Okay, guys, we are uh, slowly but surely making our way out. Kind of tempted to just like literally run out of here, but I don't really think that's a good idea. And you don't know what you're about to encounter. Um, just kind of makes things a little more traumatizing and scarier. Good back there? What? What? I just heard like two guys talking. I hear something rumbling in the distance. That was my stomach. Oh, no, 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 no. It was definitely not your stomach. It was louder than that. Oh, let's get out of here before Killian comes after. Yeah. <sighs> oh my god, look at this. I just killed one. Yeah, I know. I got a few too myself. But the fucking, I'm literally bleeding everywhere because of these pieces of Look at that freaking view though, oh my god. At least we get to see the sunset. Yeah, that's that is pretty cool. absolutely <laughs> Wow. That's pretty badass right there, guys. You're telling me, bro. Wow. Well, I think I heard something too. Yeah? Yeah. Tell me, bro. Sounded like talking. Sorry. I'm a selfie guy. Take a lot of okay. I gotta capture the moment, you know. Yeah. Show my 100%. mom and dad. <laughs> my mom and dad uh, I, I, w I would stop too, but um, honestly, I just kind of want to get the hell out of here at this point after finding those notes. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah. Just, just yeah. Like yeah. something's not right about this place. I kind of feel it. Well, we have 33 minutes. I think we'll be right. <sighs> okay. I don't even think I could run right now. I literally have a bunch of rocks in my shoes. Yeah, I'm glad we didn't have to. <laughs> Did you hear that? It's like somebody yelled from back there. I'm telling you, bro, I keep hearing things from back there. I swear I still hear something. Whoa! Oh, shh! Bro, get out of here! Get out of here! Go, 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 go! Oh my god! Be careful, be careful. Go, 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 just go, just go, go. Something stabbing my foot. Ah, shit. Oh my god. Holy. Just get in the car and get the hell out of here. You, you got the keys, right? Yeah. Holy cow. All right guys, um, we're still kind of like near where we were earlier, um, maybe like half an hour away. Also forgot to mention, um, well. Hey listen. There's a car in the distance. I hear that. You can hear, it's, it sounds like it's driving on, there's gravel. Yeah. We were gonna take the car further up here, but. Where is that? No idea. Why is the car still on? I don't know. I locked it. This car's weird. It's so weird. And the right. alarm is so like... It's odd. It's, it's really bad. <laughs> very, uh, very odd. But uh, anyways, what was the intention when we went to the ghost town? I oh my goodness. I to ask you that. What's wrong? I took a screenshot of it. I'll let you know. Uh, okay. Listen, bro, I, I can't remember what I ate for... Yeah. Breakfast. Okay, so, um, yeah, that was kind of freaky, but, uh, we used another intent, missing persons, and, um, it brought us here. It's saying that the intent is, like, around that corner. The only problem is, look at this road. I was, like, literally about to drive up this road. We were gonna go around back, but the whole road is, like, completely flooded, so we couldn't even go through. So we came around this way to try and go through to get to the same point, mm -hmm. and this is what we have to deal with. <laughs> I'm pretty confident that our rental uh, tank will probably handle it, but um, 
I don't on know. the off chance we do get a flat, right? we're screwed. I just don't want to take take too many chances. But look so. at the, the little flowers. Aww, they're cute. Pretty. Here, let me get you one. Thank you. One for you. Oh. And more for you. So cute. You like it? It's wonderful. I love it. Um, all right, let's uh, head to this coin feeder. You gotta have fun in these situations, because if you're not having fun, exactly, right? then you what are you doing? So seriously all the time. You I don't know. Too serious and then, you know, it's just serious. Hey, brother, man, that's barbed wire. Huh? That's barbed wire. Look, right here. That's You're legit barbed wire. I thought I heard a duck. No, that was my ass. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, I didn't think they have ducks in New Mexico. Maybe they do. I what is this pink thing on this fence? Oh. See? It was a balloon. Oh, it is a balloon. Why? Why a pink balloon? And a black balloon. Didn't people say that like pink might mean like trespassing or something? I have no freaking idea. Bro. Yeah, well look at all this. What are they protecting? Those shrubs, apparently. Or are they protecting us from something? Maybe. Ow, ow, ow. My ankle. What the hell is that? I'm um, okay. Uh, I saw just a random flower pot right there. Huh? That reminds me of the flower pot I found the other day. Yeah, right? Mine was dug into the ground. Alright, something bit me on my damn ankle. It's killing me. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, ankles. Ah. Oh, I don't know what's going on here. I, I, I don't know. We, well, we do know that something's going on with the car. Something's moving over here. There's nothing in it. What if it's a skinwalker, Angela? <laughs> the pot is a skinwalker? No, 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 that I'm hearing over oh, here. Oh, yeah, you're right. I mean, they do live here. Ah, uh, bro, can you hold this for a sec? Something's in my shoe and it's killing me. Bro, I literally just had the same situation. I don't know if it happened from the ghost town. I'm pretty sure my foot is probably filled with blood by now. Um... You might need a titty shot. Or yeah, shot. I literally, so something was like pinching my shoe and I thought it was a, my shoe, my foot, and I thought it was a rock the entire time. As it turned out, there was a nail in my shoe and luckily it didn't pass the memory foam, but it was still like kind of jabbing my foot. Jab, 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 jab. Imagine we ran into a rattlesnake, I wouldn't even be able to run properly. Oh uh, yeah. Sounds like a... What? I heard something. What'd you hear? Oh, kind of sounded like laughing. <sighs> For fuck's sake. I don't know if there's people down there. You see a little bag right there? Yeah, I see that. Or oh, my foot is in so much pain. It literally it's feels like it's on fire. Pain. I don't know. I'm like limping. I, it hurts. I'm really not maybe, trying to complain maybe, as much. Maybe you caught a nail too. Maybe. You should check the bottom of your shoe. Let me see. Wanna check? No, it's on the side of my ankle. That's what's killing me. It's right here. Hey, we could slide under the barbed wire right there if you want. I'm good. I think. <sighs> let me just grab this thing. Oh, frozen. Yeah. What was your intent for this one? Missing persons. You ever hear the conspiracy about Frozen? No, what's the conspiracy? I, I think I have actually. About, okay, so Does it have to do with Walt Disney? Yeah, how his head was... Uh, he wanted to be like cryogenically frozen or yes. whatever, right? So, so if you ever search up Frozen Disney, yeah. it would like you would eventually find forums of that. Yeah. Talking and about how his head or his body is... Like, yeah, they made claims that apparently um, the conspiracy is that they created the movie to drown out the Google searches. Yes. Yep. And they flushed so much money into the advertising where it became like the biggest movie on the planet for years and years. Yeah. It worked. Well, it I definitely mean, I, I bet 90 worked. Of you guys I mean, if it's kids. true, these are just theories, obviously. Yeah, these are conspiracies. We don't know. Yeah, we don't know. But I'm just saying, those of you who have kids, I know yeah. you, your guys' kids probably love... I mean, it was a good movie. 
Don't get me wrong. Oh yeah, I don't. Let's say let it go. Yeah. Okay, let's hear. I got right. the hold that for a sec. There's a little uh, face there with a uh, mustache. Izzy. <laughs> Izzy, I don't know who Izzy is. Izzy Bella. Let's get one of those handle things. Probably. We should be careful because what if we open this and like a fucking rattlesnake jumps out? That would be the worst night of my life. Right? Well, actually, worst night of your life. Okay, no rattlesnake. Thank God. Got a bunch of stuff in there in here though. Look at that picture there, that scared the shit out of me. What picture? Oh, right shit, there. Like little kids. Oh, it is a kid's suitcase. Yeah. Hey, it's the girl from Toy Story. Yeah, I don't remember her name, but. I <laughs> Woody's, think was... Woody's side piece. Yeah, Woody's mistress. Okay, be... hold on, hold on. Something's, something's going on behind us. Here, give me one sec. Yeah. Who goes there? I'm just double checking. This goes on and on and on. Again? Does our car have problems? Is the battery dying? That's like the sixth time that's happened. I can't even see through here, it's so dead. Well, we do know that someone was near our, our car earlier, so. But yeah, what's going on? Sorry. I don't know, I'm just kind of baffled by this. I'm trying to put her hat on, but it's clearly not working out. We got little kitty clothes. It's, bro, that's a small shirt. That's like, what, six months? Probably, yeah. Uh, zero to three months, actually. Damn it. What was that? Well, yeah. That's the stuff I'm hearing, bro. Is the skinwalkers? You didn't bank with us. I hope not. We got a uh, burby. We are near Navajo. Uh... Little a chick. <laughs> it's quacking. Yeah, it felt a little, uh, a little dense. So, what's quacking, Angel? Little lion. You didn't get the joke. Oh, that's that's cute. What does it say? It says little lion backer. This one is. Oh, six like a line backer. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I always do that <laughs> in my videos. What the hell happened to you, Pick the Throat? This is the third fing time. What? These knives. Oh, the knives? I thought it was like an ad for the new uh, Winnie the Pooh horror movie. You, you saw about that? No, I haven't. You really? There's a new Winnie the Pooh horror movie. It's a sippy cut. They wear the piglet mask and kill people. It's a little sticky. I just got more clothes. This one says, happy every day. Looks like there's clothes for both a boy and girl. Yeah, there's a bunch of toothbrushes in here. Like literally like a dozen of them. A Must hat. have been a long trip. Sun smart. With crayons. Um... I don't know what that is. Oh, I think it's dental floss. Floss. The plastic thingy. And that's it. There's a couple of crayons, actually. What about the pictures? Yeah. Can't forget the yellow toothbrush. My favorite. Anything written on the back? Nope. Not a single thing. We got these two creepy looking guys. I mean, that one looks kind of creepy. He just, he just has this gaze to him in this one. Sorry about that guys, the uh, battery decided to die. Um, so, <laughs> yeah. The battery's like, you know what, I'm gonna die right now. Right? It's just like, you know what, I've had enough for today. I'm just gonna take a break. You know, just shut the camera down and no. I am one with battery, honestly. Yeah, it's getting, but, uh, getting there. This is really weird, dude. What I'd if this say. is like missing persons? I mean, it could be. We got we got to play devil's advocate with everything, right? right? 
It could be that because that's what our intent is, right? But yeah. also we could also like go along and say maybe we're at like a little tourist area and someone maybe just dropped their vacation bag or you know? Is that a piss stain? I don't know what that is, bro. This thing is like it looks like it's been here for a while. It's like if they It's strange because wouldn't somebody have like come through here at some point and noticed it? Not There's... on this road, I'll tell you that much. I don't know. That's uh it's a bit concerning to me because I mean this is New Mexico. We are very close to the border. We know what happens at the border. Um, you know. What happens at the border? Trafficking? Well, I thought you were gonna say, you know, on the border, the restaurant. Yeah, love that. It's bro. all right. I know you love it. Personally, I think it's overrated, but if you like it, that's cool. Um, all right. So, what do we do with this? Do we just leave it here? Do we take it to the cops? Thanks. That's for saying it's overrated. <laughs> it is. I don't take. It I mean, back. here's the thing, and everyone always asks, yeah. "Why do you guys never bring stuff to the police?" Well, here's the thing. If we do, we tend to do it off camera. Mm -hmm. And regardless, sometimes when we do, you know what the police say? What in the heavens are we going to do with this? Yeah, exactly. Like, what like are they supposed to you're do bringing about? us, for example, blank. Mm -hmm. You know, I brought a phone before. I brought tablets before. I brought et cetera, et cetera. And they would just like, yeah, uh, we'll do what we can. Uh, we'll call you if anything and never get a phone yeah. call back. It's true, man. Like the amount of times, like, dude, I had my, my car back home broken into. I had it literally keyed. Like Same. they actually damaged my car. I've had weird footage, all sorts of odd things. And... Same thing. They literally, like, what are they going to do about it? They get so many calls all the time about random stuff. Like, there's literally not much that they can do, right? So, I don't know. I mean, maybe we'll take it anyways and then we'll decide after. Sure. I guess. Down for that. Um, yeah, I guess we'll uh, head back to the car for the time being. That was really f***ing weird, though. <sighs> My foot hurts. Ah, uh, yeah, same. So did you figure out what was wrong with your foot? <laughs> no, I just think I am going crazy. Sure. Oh, f that. Oh, hell. I don't want to find out, bro. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, sorry, sorry. I forgot. Yeah, sorry, sorry. Come on, come on, come on. You good? Oh, shit, seriously? What was that, bro? Dude. Was that well, remember, I heard something. That was a laugh. Was that not the same fucking laugh from the other night? I, I honestly can't remember. I, I always wonder, like, if is it, is it like speakers, maybe? Is it people? I don't know, like. I thought I dropped something back there, but I don't think I'm going back. No, hell no. I Come back the in the morning. Yeah, I got the keys. Well, I think we're good. Let's just get the f out of here. Yeah, let's do it. All right, see you. Uh, bye. Good? Yes, sir. Oh, I'm tired. You tired? I'm jazz. Uh, funny. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, this is, uh, this trip has been crazy. We've experienced literally so much. Um, in such a short period of time We just had something insane happen um, Something that kind of ties in like between something that we vlogged Can I explain what happened? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so I'm not gonna explain the whole thing If you want to see it for yourself, you're gonna have to go watch it on Jazz's video um, But we were in a city known as Vaughn, New Mexico uh, From here, it's probably like what two hours? Or something like that? About two and a half, yeah. Yeah, something like that. So we were there yesterday. We drove through during the day and uh, we literally just stopped at a gas station. We noticed that there was a random abandoned building behind it, uh, which was like some water department building or something like that. We went in there, explored it, and we noticed that there was this doll. And Jazz even literally pointed out like, oh look, there's a doll there. It still has like the tags on it. And he was like, oh, it's, uh, it's cute. Um, yeah, we ended up leaving. Didn't really obviously make anything of it. We drove all the way to Roswell, did like a loop around, 
I came back and um, we decided to do, you decided, you're like, oh, let's go back to Vaughn. And because uh, Jazz wanted to try and run an intent over there. And it worked. It literally brought you somewhere, and then I tried one, and it brought me to the water department. Literally that exact same building, which was really f***ing weird. And we went in there, heard some weird noises. We saw somebody there, but apart from that, we noticed that the doll was missing. But in place of it is was those shoes that you guys saw. Well, um, we're now back in Albuquerque. The following day, and. Jazz literally just found the doll. Literally, what we assume is the same one. We haven't had a chance to go back through the footage yet. But the footage is back at the hotel. Yeah, it's literally on our laptops because um, we wanted to compare. But we're like 95% sure that this doll is the same one. Um, we just had a weird experience. Somebody literally did something near to us. And uh, yeah, it was just it's just wild. This whole trip in general has just been wild. So we came over here. Um, reason being is because we wanted to run another point inside in the area and uh, just to see what would happen. We were gonna leave, but we're like, you know what? Let's just try one more. And uh, we ran an intent. Uh, I believe it was from Jennifer Miller. Jennifer Miller. She Shout out, the Jen. Intent, your future. Just wanted to see what would happen. Cool. And it decided that it was gonna bring us to this park. The creepy thing is, we noticed that there is a van literally sitting right there, like a. Creepy, you know, van that some dude would probably be giving out candy to little children. Um, <laughs> kind of weird, right? The dude inside is wrapping his candy right now. Right? What did he like, say about the, me? I don't think there's anybody in the van. Is there? But there's the aluminum foil on the front. Oh, I think. shit. So you can't even really tell. I'm going to try. Um, all right. Um, ready? Born ready. Born ready? Are you sure? I'm good now. We don't have to go to the washroom. Not anymore. I just let it all out. The only reason I say is because I'm a little nervous. Because, you know. Rattlers? Yeah. yeah, I hope we won't find any. Please. Please, God, please. <laughs> Use area at your own risk. What? That's what it says. Why does it say that? Do not use picnic area during high winds. High winds? Yeah. Okay. Is that like a thing that happens here? Sorry. I you did say it is monsoon season, right? It was monsoon did season. Did it like flood recently? Could have. I wouldn't know. I don't even know what's going on back home. <laughs> I know. I, I'm hearing that it's cold back in Canada, but you know. It's the one country where you can get literally a sunburn and frostbite in the same day. I guess the same would go for you guys. Yeah. Mostly. A little less, uh. Extreme, but yeah. Okay. Currently out here looking for my future. It is one o'clock in the morning. And uh Wait, listen, listen. What? Dogs? Not the dogs. I don't even care about the dogs. Did you hear something? I heard like a ring. Ring ring ring. Alright, never mind. Maybe I'm just losing it. Probably that. Maybe. Sounds like some high voltage over here. Oh yeah, I hear that. Something's moving over here. Sounds like some things are moving around. Shifting. Skip the loop do 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 do. It's a cool area. Yeah. That looks like a picnic bench I'd never use ever. Right? Like, dude. There's the one like over there. Plants, man. Like, yeah, use at your own risk. The risk is you guys not using landscaping right. services. Like, dude, it's called a trimmer. <laughs> it's not that hard. Manscape 3.0 sponsored. Yeah, like the plants here are so like overgrown. Yeah, it's nasty. Bottle of water. Would you like a bottle of water? Kinda. I'm kind of thirsty right now. Angel. Yeah. Uh, lockbox. No wood burning. Okay. Well, I guess 
good that we don't have any wood to burn. Says you. You didn't check my bag. You have wood in your bag? <laughs> Is it in your bag or? or my bag, Angela, not my bag. Your, your what? Not my bag. Your bag? My bag. Ba 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 bag. Okay there, bud. What you got there? What happened? Nothing, you know, just inspecting. <laughs> Inspector Hector. Just making sure. I noticed something though. There's a big wet spot on this table. Yeah. And there's a bottle of water. So the thing is, like, that would dry up, right? Like relatively quick? Yeah. Like, There's like bugs on there too. I can see them so I was around. thinking maybe someone was here recently. I mean, yeah, clearly. Clearly. Um, I mean, more so probably in this section than that section. All right. Who wants to be a millionaire question? This is the million dollar question right here. Angelo, yep. what is inside the box? Is it A? Uh, damn it. This is on my channel. I, I can't even remember what I said. Ready? I was born ready, brother. I told you this already. Is it a rattlesnake? No. I suppose I will come over there. That is a cross angel. Yes. And those are pictures with the glasses. Oh dear God. I like the tape in the middle. Right? Levanta. Levanta? Mercedo 10. I get closer to see that one. See it? Yep. Got it. What the hell does that mean? Sorry guys, I don't speak uh, Latin. So. You know that's Latin? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> Finnish for all I know. <laughs> Are you finished? Finished? Mm hmm. Not. Our favorite. Wow, that guy has some. Hmm. Nothing, nothing. I said that guy has some sick neck neck tats. I know, right? What a weird photo. It's a very close up. Yeah. You notice this like weird spot in her eye? What is that all about? Probably just a flash, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe like a mugshot. Who the hell are these people? No idea. It's got some. Nick Tats. There's mm -hmm. like somebody like sitting behind him, I guess. That looks like a mugshot. That, yeah. That dude looks uh, kind of scary. They have the same mustache. Like straight out of Breaking Bad right there. Oh. What if they're not real mustaches? For a second I was going to say is it the same person, but it's Yeah, come not. on, Angel. What? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, well, the, the stash really is. No, I know, I'm kidding. Oh, dear weird. God. What is it? It says CJNG. I don't know what that is. Criminal Justice National Guard. I have no I, I, I just think? said. I think it was on the top of my head. If that's right, that's crazy. Never seen that trap before, ever. Oh my goodness gracious, what are we looking at? They have like uh... Numbers on their own. Yeah, I know, I see that. I can only really make out this one though. I've seen this photo before. Have this, you? This one, yeah. Cool. Looks like a... Couple. Mm-hmm. CJNG. Oh shit. Again. Hello? Did I lock the car? Oh, no, I did. Still going on. Someone's over there. It sounds yeah. like a metal 
Dong, dong. Let's bring this back to the car. Yeah. CJNG criminal just. Oh. Can you see it? Get a good shot of that. I think the last word is consequences. I'm just going off of context clues. I don't see anybody. Must have been from under the bridge though. The bumpy old troll who lives under the bridge. What the f does it even mean? No te quiram. You don't want. No te queremos. Something here. Aquí. So I can read Spanish? I can like context clue us. Vete ahora o atente a los consecuencias. The last word is definitely consequences. So I can read Spanish. I can't translate it though. What if it doesn't mean consequences? What if it means something like. What else could it mean though? Butcher shop? Butcher shop? I mean, uh, okay. You never know. Could mean a whole lot of Spanish things. is an interesting language, man. Uh, yeah, that was, uh... What'd you hear? Nothing, I'm just trying to see if there's somebody there. It was like... Very weird. Loud, yeah. It sounded all, either like metal or like glass. No, it was definitely metal. It sounded like a metal pipe or metal poke. Yeah. Definitely That's... reminded, it gave me vibes of that guy who was part one. Yeah. Really our first day here. We were up in the mountain, and there was a dude walking around with a gigantic pipe. Like, I get walking sticks, but like, dude, this dude was walking around with a pipe, like, like banging it yes. over rocks. And he was dragging it, it along it the floor. Just, it was just very unnecessary. There was no reason for any of that. If it was like, there was something in the I didn't want to find out. <laughs> <laughs> you can't say it, blame you, man. Cool little area. It is a cool area. But big, big patches of grass scare me here. <laughs> yeah, I don't blame you on that one. That's for sure. Huh. What was that? CJ. What does that say right there? What? Right here, carved in or written onto this. S K O L, or is that an I? M A C I? Did you hear that? Yeah, I did. That was like a whistle. Uh-uh. Not a fan. Hundred percent. Sounds like it literally sounds as if somebody's whistling. Oh, lost dog. Oh. Little peach. Well, this area is eerie. Right after your experience. I'm just trying to keep the mood light right now. Yeah, me too. <laughs> yeah, it's a really weird experience. Um, Weird. But if you guys can speak Spanish, I guess let us know what that said. Or if anybody knows what CJNG means. Never heard of it. Criminal Justice National Guard. I honestly do. Yeah. <laughs> it leads out that that's what it meant. I'm kidding. Um, but yeah, this has been uh, one weird adventure. <laughs> I'd say. Just the, the whole trip overall has just been absolutely Bananas. wild. Coming this close to death. Finding cats stuck in our car. Um, uh, just really weird, weird stuff. But okay, I might do one more and then, uh, and I think that's it for New Mexico. Sounds good, man. Are you ready to go home? Uh, yes. Yeah? Yes. Me too. Honestly, I'm gonna go home and probably sleep for like 24 Ever. hours. Yeah. And, I think we yeah, deserve and it. And then get back to work. <laughs> yeah. And then we'll be back somewhere else. Yeah, that's, uh, I guess you wanted to do one more. 
right? Yeah, I guess we could take turns, me, you, and then yeah. call it a night. Yeah, we're gonna do one more each, and uh, that's uh, pretty much it. But, cool. Uh, we'll see you at the next one. All right, there you go, Mr. Cameraman. How does it feel to be a cameraman, Jazz? It's all right. It's all right. Yeah. Probably this area has a lot of dogs. <laughs> Which is literally the, the funniest shit I've heard. Bye. Anyway, um, so yeah, we ran another intent using the same one, your future. And uh, apparently it's led us here. The point is at that gazebo down there, apparently. And uh, yeah, I'm really tired. Yeah. We got a really early flight tomorrow, so let's go see what we got. Maybe uh, woke up the neighborhood. <laughs> this is that nice car. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Something right here. Oh, or is that connected to it? It's definitely connected to it. What is that? <laughs> cool. Okay. Yeah, nice park though. Yeah, not too shabby. Oh man. That one dog in the back sounds like it's getting. Oh, it's a cockroach. <laughs> I hate you jerk. cockroaches. Oh my god. Burn! <laughs> I don't think that works. What do you mean? It's an old light. <laughs> I mean, Hashtag ad. Pretty hot, right? <laughs> yeah, in your hands. Yeah, for real. But that means that they're working. You said the placebo? Yeah, the placebo is supposed to have something. Well, you'll, you can catch me at the basketball court. <laughs> you know where I'll be at. Alright. No, seriously, let's split up. Take a, take a look around. Before the rest of the neighborhood wakes up. Nice basketball court, wow. All right guys, relax, relax. I if Angelo found it. Yes. Yes sir. Painting actually. That is really nice. Right? Reminds me of like Dia de, de los Muertos. Yeah. Come and see. Doesn't work. Definitely not an Olight. If it was an Olight, it would work. A Dorsey. But it's heat. That says the same thing. I'll come and see. Yeah. Was it a cassette? I'm finding myself. No. Oh. Steve Green, find us faithful. He says, come and see. Is it really? Yeah. The actual oh, yeah, name yeah. of the song, come and see. For the glory... Of God. Of, for the glory of the Lord. Oh, it's close. The song is, cherish the treasure. Praise you. It's from, uh, California? Mm-hmm. Also Vancouver, BC. Joyful, joyful, we adore thee. Thank you. That's cool. <laughs> Seek. All right. You will find coordinates. Seek and you will find coordinates. And it also says to leave the city. Well, we did. Numerous times. Well, yes, we did. We did. To be fair. Um, You're gonna look the coordinates up? Yeah. Cool. I'm gonna take a look around, see if there's anything else around. Oh, wait. Is there something? Oh, never mind. Just graffiti.
Those dogs really want to say hello. I know. I want to go pet them. I know. Me too. Who's a good boy? You, you good boy. <laughs> Who's a good boy? Nine, five, three, four. Please don't be far. Oh, it's only seven minutes away. Sick. What is it? What? What is it? Is it something exciting? Oh, it looks sick. What is it? Is it like a banana bill? Read it. Read it. It might look a little familiar to you. Oh, it's our hotel. Yeah. Oh, my dear God. Well, that's... That happened. You have your room key, right? In the car. Do you have your room key? I never brought it. Okay, I guess I was the only one who brought it. I told you, you can't one. trust me with a room key. <laughs> I, I shoved it into my wallet, so... We'll check when we get back to the car. Actually, you know what? Maybe we should go check it out. What the f***? Maybe. Holy cow. I, like, I kind of thought... That it was gonna be like like last time, where you know it sent us to Kings Park, which was crazy. I'm not going back to Kings Park if that's what you're wondering. No, I'm gonna take a little break from Kings Park to be honest. Yeah, I'm that, taking like that a. That last time was was a bit much. I think I'm. I'll go back in my next lifetime when I respawn as a cricket or spricket. <laughs> I'm gonna respawn in the tunnels of Kings Park. Mm. Oh, you good boy. You, 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 you. Hola. Hola, papito. Hey, he's a big boy. I love how you took the garbage with you, basically. What? I said, I look how you took the garbage with you, basically. I don't even know why I grabbed that. He's literally on top of a garbage can. I'm kind of in panic mode at the moment. Okay, I have the key. Okay, cool. Success. Success. We're good on that front. Um, at the same time, someone knows where we're staying. Dude, like... We'll lift that's left for us, but... Yeah. At the same time. Let's go big. Let's go back and make sure everything's... But yeah, let's go now, bro. Okay, let's do it.